Uh, but for obvious reasons, the whole situation was critically changed in a matter of uh, days. And so today, I would like to dedicate this, my webinar, to my Italian partners, company B Medica, to Maria Grazia, Lino, Giulia, for all your staff, for all your agents, for all our Italian trainers, expert trainers, we are good friends and um, Ciao, my dear colleagues, and uh, especially dedicate to all my Italian colleagues, this especially for you and, of course, for another doctors. And uh, today I would like, uh, um, but I will start, yes, I will start with a disclosure for that doctors who doesn't know about me, about my experience and my story. So I'm working for Aptos company. It's not easy to say I'm working or living in Aptos company because uh, uh, I'm uh, one, uh, let's say, George Solomonidze is my husband. So we are a big family and Aptos is our fourth children. And uh, also, I'm expert trainer uh, of Aptest Methods, trainer of uh, Allergan. And today, I will present my own experience. Forza Italy, hi from uh, hi to Spain. I wish you to stay healthy. Hi from Uzbekistan, Egypt. I would like to welcome all of you. KCA, yes, Dubai. Hi, 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 my dear. Hi, Poland, yes. Yes, my doctors, my dear doctors, I, I truly believe that we will uh, see each other in the nearest future in uh, a huge congresses. And yes, we will return to our life. Uh, hi, hi from Switzerland, Czech Republic, Australia, Albania, Albania so sounds like Albina, yes, Turkey, Romania, Saudi Arabia. It's it's a really it's a honor to be today with you, Morocco, Libya, KCA. Okay, I will follow my presentation. Uh, okay, I would like to talk about Nano. Nano is a very interesting methodic and uh, with a high request of interest from you, first of all, from, from the doctors. The Nano line includes three main products, Nano Excellence Method, Nano Spring Method, and the Nano Vidis Method. All three methods differ from each other in design and indi uh, indication for use. So let's analyze analyze each of these methods in detail. And I would like to start with Nana Excellence method. My opinion is that this is one of the top products that should be included in the total, uh, in the tool of any practitioner. This is the same visage, but in short form, seven centimeters. And I'm sure that many of you who are using our methods, exactly visage users, will agree with me that there are some clinical cases where only one package of visage is not always enough for full face um, treatment, and especially if we want to recreate volume, for example, cheekbone area, or if we would like to, to do uh, additional lifting of the eyebrows. Uh, and in the past, our company received requests from the uh, uh, doctors and our partners to manufacture uh, of indi individual two or four uh, visage cannulas just for the further correction. So let's say nano excellence can be considered as a great addition to the main product visage and also is ideal for the correction of only one zone. And uh, let's talk about indications. First of all, lifting and changing the shape of the eyebrow. The main advantage of Nana Excellence is, first of all, easy to, uh, of use, instant result, lack of gematomas, and minimal swelling. If we will compare, for example, with the uh, same needle to G, which is more difficult technically, and sometimes for beginners, it's not easy to start to work with this technique. And if we are talking about volume restoration and lifting of cheekbone area, believe me, sometimes using only nano excellence, we really can achieve 
good volume in the cheekbone area, for example, uh, the same uh, result we can achieve with the classical visage, uh, only with the two or three cannulas. In the case of the classical visage, do we always need uh, a whole package for cheekbone area? You will answer me, no, of course not, Dr. Albina, what for? It's not, uh, uh, it's not, it, it will be too much for, for this area. And I will absolutely agree with you. And that's for, therefore, one pack of non-excellence is more than enough on this area. And again, I will, uh, I will repeat that uh, almost no swelling and uh, the shortest period of rehabilitation. So what is this non-excellence? So two cannulas of non-excellence, it's the same like one cannula of uh, Excellence Visage Classic. So if we were uh, talking about cheekbone area, let's say uh, one package uh, we divide to both sides. So five cannulas of non-Excellence uh, is the same like two and a half cannulas of classical one uh, Excellence Visage. Another indication, jawline correction, lifting of soft tissues. Um, and again, I will repeat that this is the same visage, but you don't need to divide thread during procedure like we were doing it with the classical visage when we were dividing one uh, 15 centimeters uh, thread uh, twice. So you just go from the tragus, the same technique, the same entry point, everything the same because it's, it's the same visage, but only seven centimeters. So you are going directly to the jawline, pull the soft tissues up and go out without cutting the end of the thread. So very comfortable and very convenient, first of all, for you. Uh, additional fixation of some mental area, what I mean. So if you use only nano excellence in some mental area, I'm sorry, but you won't see the wow effect or great result. No, uh, don't wait for this result. It won't be. But if you will use nano excellence with combination with a thread to G, uh, classical visage or non-excellence with needle to G. Uh, I prefer this combination most of all. So uh, in such cases, you will get this additional fixation by creating a frame and then a needle to G will be much better fixed, uh, fixed inside. Another very interesting indication, um, and I will also uh, not try to repeat that Nana Excellence is truly a universal product, as unique as uh, classical visage. Even seven centimeters can tighten excess skin in the knee area, as well as tighten excess skin in the navel. When I'm doing correction, for example, of the body, I'm using uh, a Nana Excellence in combination with the basic methods, like, for example, Excellence Body or uh, Excellence Visage. For example, if I'm creating an abdomen, I'm, I'm taking uh, two packages of uh, excellent body. Or if I don't have body, I'm taking the classical visage free packs plus non-excellence exactly for the navel. Uh, so uh, this is short video, just a minute. I need some time because I'm blonde. Yeah. Yes, so you have seen this uh, short movie uh, um, on the last webinar. Yes, this is my patient. Uh, we were, I were creating her um, a good, uh, nice uh, shape of her eyebrows. Mostly she wanted uh, to improve her uh, natural asymmetry. So how to find entry point uh, for this uh, area indication? So, uh, 
uh, from two or three centimeters from the end of the eyebrow near to the hairline border. You can choose uh, uh, an enter point. It can be more lateral or more vertical, depending which direction you would like to elevate the eyebrow. And so the threads should be and would be located in the middle and upper periorbital compartments. This technique is free floating way of insertion. This movie was uh, filmed a couple years ago, uh, but uh, since uh, that time I really changed my technique to V-shape with a point of fixation when we are inserting cannula uh, or I will show it this technique on a cheekbone area, uh, but uh, when we're inserting a cannula uh, and on another back way, we are not exiting totally. We are just uh, turning the way of the tip of our cannula and going forward to another direction. So I will, I will go back to my presentation. Just a minute. Yes, yes, I'm here. Yes. Uh, so uh, even after two weeks, you can see quite good result. And uh, you can see that uh, asymmetry is corrected and practical, no gematomas, no bruising, nothing. So she is living her uh, life uh, without no uh, discomfort after the procedure. Another case, quite difficult case. It's always difficult to work with an aging patient. Yes, of course, like a practitioner, I understand that it's better uh, would be for her to go uh, to blepharoplasty operation. But she truly believed that she is too young and it's really too early for her to, to make a surgeon on her eyelid. So that's why I just tried uh, to create it, some result, and it was uh, interesting for me what kind of result I could achieve. But even uh, with a nano excellence, even with a one pack, you can see really nice, very soft, very gentle result, but she was very satisfied with this result. And uh, you can see, uh, yes, not be lifting of uh, the end of the eyebrow, but even the upper eyelid, um, lifted just a couple of millimeters, but it really looks much better. Uh, young patients without excess skin uh, are the best candidates for eyebrow lifting, as in this case. Uh, so you see, it really works like, for example, she would, uh, for example, it's really a lifting result. I, I really created a new form uh, of her brows, and I think most of you uh, like this technique. Yes, it's very simple, it's very comfortable, and the product is not so expensive, for example, like, for example, Visage, the classical one, or uh, Visage uh, uh, Soft. Uh, next. Next video is just, I wanted to show you this V-shape uh, uh, technique on a cheekbone area. Yes. So this is how these products uh, look like. Um, yes, uh, George shows how we can create. So we are collecting these soft tissues and going forward for, through all these uh, tissues. Uh, now, uh, without removing his cannula, he just turning the tip of this cannula and going forward uh, to another direction. And uh, we are inserting in this area all these five cannulas. Please uh, don't try to save uh, any uh, cannulas. Uh, it's necessary to insert all these five cannulas. And this is how the patient looks like immediately after the procedure. And even now you see that she really looks very, very good. 
Okay, I will follow next presentation, uh, my presentation, and let's discuss my work. Uh, yes, also aging patient. Yes, uh, maybe uh, most of you were thinking that uh, it's better to do, for example, uh, thread to G on her jawline, or um, and to do with a combination with a classical visage uh, on her mid uh, face, but. Mm, um, I'm always trying to find the easiest way for my patient because I understand that tomorrow she should go for her work and she has her own uh, lifestyle and she has no time for extra skin or extra rehabilitation. So that's why I decided just to take Nana Excellence one pack and Nana Visage, even for her jawline. And you can see how much better it looks like. And you can see a very nice shape of uh, her cheeks very very gentle very soft and uh, very natural looks okay next one very interesting case uh, because uh, sometimes with this problem like excess skin on the knees uh, are coming very very pretty women and uh, one of them uh, told me, Dr. Albina, I don't want some surgical intervention. Please, I think something uh, without rehabilitation, without uh, some uh, signs of the procedure. So this problem, uh, I think, was very good solved. And even uh, one pack on one side and one pack on another side of Nana Excellence, it's uh, more than enough for the first stage. Why I prefer this procedure? Because it's really not painful. Uh, some discomfort they are feeling during 24 hours. And on the third day, uh, there is practically no pain. Uh, yes, some, uh, I am giving them recommendation to uh, try to avoid some uh, exercises during first week. But uh, what is uh, the first benefit? They see result even even after one week uh, uh, and uh, sometimes they are ready to repeat this procedure after uh, two or three or four months and I think why not it's a very good for first of all for us and for our patients uh yes next one uh, next method uh, is nano spring method so uh, uh, our company position we po um, we position this product as a filler alternative uh, because after insertion into soft tissues spring strange and contract in volume without interfering with the facial movement so it's very comfortable for us uh, therefore uh, the use of springs in more uh, in more dynamic areas such as uh, nasolabium falls or marinate lines or leak <coughs> augmentation or uh, uh, no steep correction is most effective so my next short video I will do it right now, just a minute. Give me just a few seconds. Yes. Uh, so uh, before inserting the carnula, there are some specific. I, I'm showing it on this movie. Uh, before inserting the carnula, you need to untwist a couple of centimeters of the thread uh, counterclockwise then in clockwise direction just to check uh, the how scrolls cannula uh, uh, before you will insert into the, the soft tissues so from one enter point i'm inserting these uh, all five centimeters and you uh, uh, you see that i'm cutting this end of this spring a uh, little bit later on this movie i will show you even on one centimeter of this spring i will show you i'm just cutting and after that i will strengthen this uh, thread and you will see on one centimeter of the spring it's about 15 20 centimeters of smooth thread so uh springs 
yes, they really can do a volumizing effect in such problematic areas like uh, Nasolabian form and marionette lines. It's and I think it's a choice uh, method of choice. Yes, this is exactly what I was talking about. You can see it's more than 20 centimeters, even one centimeter and half of the spring. And you can see the difference on both sides, even immediately after. And I would like to repeat one more time, no gematomas, no extra swelling. And they really look very nice immediately after the procedure. Uh, yes, clinical ca cases, yes, before and uh, one year, even one year after mm, another. So I would like to stop on this case. Why? Uh, please uh, notice uh, that there is a second of nasal ambient compartments and the formation of pronounced fold, and this is not even a simple wrinkle, let's say it's more scar. So in this case, one milliliter of HA filler will not give the desired result, uh, but uh, two millimeters, um, two cc uh, of hyaluronic acid will be too much because it will give us a high risk of gel migration. So if we will compare fillers and uh, spring methods for aging patients. First of all, springs uh, will never migrate and are uh, always located at the, the injection site and they don't interfere with the natural facial uh, expressions. So some more, some more clinical cases with a na uh, nana spring method on uh, nasolabial and fall. I think it's a great idea because, for example, in our clinic, it costs a little bit less. For example, we, if we, I will compare with the Juvederm, the fourth number and uh, or uh, ju juvederm for leaves so uh, it's um, it's normal price it takes me about 10 minutes and um, let's say the uh, procedure is very very uh, good for the patient because the duration period will be last up to two years okay uh, next method vitis method so I already spoke about nano excellence. Yes. Uh, so nano excellence, first of all, is for replace uh, and the fixation of soft tissues. Nano spring, we already spoke about this, uh, that it's uh, very good for uh, filling of soft tissues. And in the case of nano uh, let's say this is a true armoring method. It's impossible to replace or fix soft tissues uh, with a smooth thread. Please uh, don't think about this. Uh, let's, uh, let's say uh, this method is just to armor soft tissue, to prepare soft uh, tissues for the barber thread, to improve the quality of the skin and to reduce the depth of the wrinkles and uh, all these we can do even with this such the simplest product like uh, uh, Vitis method. So indications uh, is first of all armoring and peeling such superficial wrinkles like tobacco wrinkles, armoring and filling, uh, filling of wrinkles on the cheeks armoring of the soft tissues or some mental area, neck uh, um, uh, uh, and in other areas. Armoring and filling of the lower eyelid area, very, very delicate area with no fat. So we should be careful with barber thread and with the spring thread. So that's why we need this method. Armoring and filling of the wrinkles in the tragus area, 
Yes, yeah, sometimes we, um, when we apply fillers, uh, it does. If we will choose a wrong G prime filler, it can stay like uh, overcorrection, and it, it will need uh, uh, just sometimes to do a strong massage there. With the Vitas, you will have no problems, and you can divide, for example, to do these wrinkles, some mental area, or cheeks, even with one pack. A morning and feeling of forehead wrinkles. Like on this clinical case, uh, this is uh, uh, my and George, uh, George's patient. She is botulinum uh, resistant patient. So for her, it was a good desire to do uh, this um, to do this uh, method. Uh, armoring and feeling of the hands. So let's speak about this a little bit in detail. Uh, good results were shown in the technique of revolumization of interosseous spaces of the hand. The entry points could be like is shown here. Some of them, it can be three, four or five. Or you can do it only with one entry point, like doing me as a dermatologist, because it's very popular uh, procedure with uh, like the same technique, like we are doing uh, with the fillers HA, we are doing only one entry point and just divide to the whole hand. So yes, it's very comfortable for us, uh, some results. Uh, I think for our trainers uh, and our partners, uh, they know this case. The, our very famous uh, nurse with a very expensive hands, let's say like this. And this is my patient uh, for um, compression uh, on the hand immediately after the procedure. And another picture shows the second hand that was not implanted. So you can see even immediately after, no bruising no gematoma so you, you it depends on you first of all but it's really very uh, comfortable procedure and it takes about 10 minutes just a minute for a minute uh, another clinical case nano is one pack before and after one month even for the such thin skin uh it, uh, yes so next is video also very interesting area this is my patient you remember this patient she is from uh, her clinical case with the uh, eyebrow lifting with nana excellence so armoring of the neck uh, is the most difficult area to work with uh, nana vitis function in this case first of all i wanted to stimulate collagen creation of the soft tissues uh, and to reduce the depth of wrinkles during marking uh, i just uh, i uh, uh, market the position and the way of insertion of my uh, threads and on the middle of the neck all my uh, uh, threads uh, uh, should be crossed between each other uh huh. And uh, try always try. Uh, please notice that I'm going as far as possible, and always trying to straight the skin on the cannula. And pay your attention, please. If there is no left the end of the thread, so always try to cut and always check your fingers because this end of the neck uh, of the thread um, will make some problems in the future. So this is how the patients look looks like even immediately after and you see no gematomas even immediately after very comfortable procedure very comfortable product and what i like most of all first of all this is a polylactic acid with caprolactone a very good skin booster okay step by step 
uh, I collected this picture especially for you. Uh, first step is marking. Uh, on one side, I marked it with a, a white pen, and on another side, I marked it with a red pen. And you can see that in the middle, I'm just Mm, uh, cr uh, crossing all, all these threads. Uh, a second stage preparation uh, with antiseptic solution is then such simplest method like nanovitis needs, uh, first of all, from us to prepare correctly our patient. This is in the process. So you can see that I'm following my marking uh, way of insertion. Uh, anesthesia for entry point with 13 gauge and 32 gauge needle solutions. I uh, using ultracaine and if you uh, have lidocaine, you can use lidocaine as well. Uh, next, um, uh, next picture shows uh, the way of insertion. And one more time, I would like to repeat. Try to uh, strain the skin on the cannula. Next picture is how the patient was looked like two weeks uh, after. How, uh, uh, just a minute. Uh, uh some signs of bruising you can see uh, this is uh, uh, how my patient looks like even after three months you can see a real good result uh, because um, it's uh, sometimes uh, uh, difficult to achieve such good result only with the skin booster but wrinkles are reduced more than twice yes and another angle of this patient and as my italian colleagues would say perfecto yes Perfecto, bellissimo. Yes, and my next patient. And I would like to stop on this picture. Why? Uh, yes, uh, this is aging patient. She is 75 years old. And she's told me, Dr. Albina, do something with me. Okay. Well, without no surgery, without no surgical intervention. Okay. So please uh, notice that she is a very problematic patient for dermatologists because, yes, she has aptosis, uh, three or four degree. Her neck is worse, but look on her lips. Uh, she did rhinoplastic about 30 years ago and the surgeon wanted to do a lipofilling on her lips. And uh, as you see, the result was not good. So what I did, I combined all the threads. So I combined Nana Springs to her lips to improve her upper lip, to uh, improve her worse lips, to create some little bit volume, not extra volume like we can achieve with the fillers just to create a good frame of her um, uh, red line. Nasalabia and fold, marionette lines were also corrected with nano spring and uh, visage to the whole face. Nano excellent, just on the cheekbone area, one pack. But you will not see like this plumped result. Why? Because she is an aging patient and her uh, fat compartments are very poor quality. So that's why I just created this line of her cheekbone area. And even some mental area uh, is really looks much better. I zoomed this picture what for. I would like to draw your attention to the quality of the skin due to the unique composition of polylactic acid and comprolactone, which gives an additional booster effect, which will last during two years. And on conclusion, I would like to say that with such methods like Nana Excellence method, Nana Spring method, Nana Vitis method, we are able to create a lifting. Sorry, 
George, something happened. Everything is fine. Don't worry. I'm not 100% or true blonde. <laughs> so even with this such method, we are able to create a lifting and a mooring of soft tissues. Fill the lipodystrophy zones with a duration up to two years. And I would like to invite all of you to our Facebook group, Aptex Experts, uh, where you can see uh, the, the same this webinar, the previous webinar of Dr. George Sulamanidze. You can share your uh, results. You can ask question for any of our trainers you can share your experience with us and uh, we uh, uh, with uh, great pleasure will answer you answer you the, all your questions and i wanted to say that you, uh, during next week you will uh, receive uh, a, a certificate of listening of this webinar and uh, i would like to announce uh, a webinar uh, which will be uh, on next monday you can join this webinars with our experts uh, with george solomonide jo uh, constantin solomonide with inventors of update method with our uh, with our expert uh, trainer nino kobaladze from russia and our trainer from spain uh, dr ruiz lopez and none of us is as strong as all of us. Please uh, stay healthy, stay strong, and everything will be fine. So I'm ready to answer your question. We have a couple of minutes just uh, for discussion. This is my husband's voice. <laughs> He's controlling everything, so. Hello, colleagues. <laughs> Albina will answer you now about questions. Here is your question, taking... Albina. Why? So, um, what slide? It is want to be used for fullness, not too tight, and to improve appearance of the skin. So, uh, nanovitis is uh, like a uh, very strong booster um, procedure. With this procedure, with a smooth uh, threads, we cannot achieve a lifting result. You were experienced over lip edema. Vitis want to be used for fullness, not to tighten it, and to improve the appearance of the skin. Yes, for the uh, lower eyelid is just to improvement. We cannot fool it, and also we can uh, correctly choose the patient. Mm -hmm. I don't see that. Thank you. All, all Egyptian loves aptas, and we. Aptas love all our doctors. Tak. What is the success rate for neck lines with Aptas Vitis? Yes, uh, I, I like this technique because these horizontal wrinkles are very difficult to work with, even with the fillers. So that's why mm, I, I'm taking one pack of Nana Vitis and it's more than enough for this area and one more time i would like to mention that only one method uh, yes it's good but to achieve very good and lifting result or full face rejuvenation uh, in this case you should combine different uh, different methods for example combination visage thread to g and nano excellence or nano spring or all of this in one time uh, um, tak, I don't know uh, why, maybe uh, I don't know how to unlock uh, properly. I think uh, uh, I lose to this uh, question. Yes. So uh, the, the question, the answer, Dr. George, please <laughs> give me a couple of minutes. Uh, yes, very good question. So you need to be uh, teached by our certif certified uh, trainer. Why? Because there are some specific. I always telling that, yes, 
Maybe you are good users of PDO, but it doesn't mean that you can insert aptas after that very easily. No. Apta stress was created from doctors to doctors. It is a very clever technique. And in the right hands, it will give you real excellent results. So that's why you should, if you have some problems, don't care about this. Do another training, uh, uh, held another hands-on training. Ask your local distributor to organize uh, hands-on training, especially for this method. Yeah, there are some specific, for example, with Nana Spring. It will take you a little bit more experience just to understand when your cannula is ready for insertion. So first of all, we should unlock our cannula and after that we can apply this do you combine with fillers are you doing at the same time or which one first do you uh, do you do in patient with jaws uh, dropping and slightly legs okay yes uh, uh, so I always combine all the technique uh, so um, I have a good presentation of combination, golden triad of aesthetic medicine. Uh, it's a combination of Botox injections, fillers, and traps. We can do in the same session fillers and threads if we are speaking about another uh, other um, uh, areas. For example, you can do fillers on mid part of the face and on the lower part of the face you can apply um, threads and if we are talking about one area and two procedures fillers and threads first of all i recommend to you to uh, in, uh, apply threads and after two weeks or three weeks just it depends of your passion. It depends of the method you was choose. Uh, so after that, if it will be necessary, you can apply uh, in the cheekbone area uh, filler or to the nasal labia and fall uh, HA fillers. Thank you from Madrid, Cuba, everybody. Hi, hi. Uh, very good presentation. Thank you. Please, could you confirm the caliber of the nano threads? Uh, it's uh, five, zero. Uh, five zero. It's five zero. Georgian. George cannot stay uh, <laughs> quiet. <laughs> Come here, George. I think you have a question. Other question. Uh, you have mentioned that Nana Vitis has a booster effect on the skin. Yes, I was mentioned this. While Dr. George, uh, in the last lecture, showed by histology that they don't actually stimulate collagen one and through formation. Uh, that's why after this video, HA was introduced. Would you explain that? Um, Yes, I will explain this. Armoring. Armoring, yes, and biostimulation uh, is creating uh, due to composition. And uh, polylactic acid with caprolactone start to stimulate the third type of the collagen after uh, one month and a half. Yes. In bro elevation is better done after Botox or no need for Botox. Yes, very good question, because um, mostly um, one of the biggest mistake is when a doctor is trying uh, to replace Botox injections. Uh, um, it's impossible, uh, even for botulinum-resistant patients. Why? Because very strong miming of the forehead uh, will destroy uh, the ways of insertion of our thread, the way of fixation of our thread. So that's why we should do first injection of botulinum toxin. After that, wait for a couple of days or one week or two days or three days, it depends on your patient. And after that, do uh, threads. Why? We are stopping uh, the muscles because I need uh, no mimic because it will give me possibility to do much stronger fixation inside. 
Uh, what about contraindications? Contraindications, uh, no, first of all, we should uh, try to, to correctly select a patient for the thread lifting. I think it's a good idea, Dr. George. What do you think about the topic of my next webinar, patient selection for the thread lifting for each part of the faces? Because next, the, week. next week is too early for me. <laughs> I'm very busy sitting at home. <laughs> so, yes, um, it's a big topic for discussion because the biggest problem of the doctors uh, when uh, high demands, for example, even with a one pack of visage, and uh, they try to divide here, 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 everywhere. And uh, in, uh, in the end, they don't see the result. So this is sometimes it makes some mistakes, uh, you know, first of all, from our side, from doctor's side. So yes, I will speak about it in detail uh, just uh, after one week, because uh, the, our new, uh, in the nearest future, uh, Dr. George with colleagues will present another very interesting no um, topic nano excellence for rhinoplastic yeah it's a good idea because uh in the past i was injected a lot of fillers in the nose area but uh what i saw i saw a big amount of complication thanks god not mine but uh, uh, many of uh, doctors here in georgia and uh, also in uh, from another republic they uh, yes, they received uh, quite a um, big amount of necrosis, uh, ischemias. So that's why um, slowly I decided not to inject fillers for such delicate areas. So since that time, yes, I'm doing visage soft uh, for correction of nose area thanks to Dr. Konstantin for this methodic. And for me, even for me, for dermatologist, yes, it uh, makes me a little bit uh, some, um, sometimes to, to think, uh, am I correctly choose my patient? But it really works. It uh, really, uh, this procedure is very loved here in Georgia, where is uh, a biggest problem with the noses, where is a very famous and very popular till today uh, operation or like uh, uh, rhinoplasty. Tak, how can we combine nano with laser uh, rejuvenation? Uh, it depends what kind of laser. If this is a, a dermal, like a CO2, um, why not? You can do it in the same, same session or you can wait uh, just a few um, days. But if in the case of high full ultrasonic machines, uh, so in this case, I uh, suggest for you, first of all, to do, for example, high full or Altera. After that, wait for one month or two months when uh, the fibrosis will be uh, created. And after that, you can insert threads. In this case, in fibrotic tissues, threads will be placed very good and they will really uh, uh, much better, um, um, re they will replace uh, these strong and heavy uh, soft tissues. Uh, so there are a lot of non-excellence for facial nerve palsy. We uh, have another webinar about fels, facial yes. palsy. Uh, non-excellence uh, for facial nerve palsy. Yes, it will be uh, after a few days a very good webinar. So please stay with us. Uh, follow our news. And yes, our company uh, always trying to support 
all of you, all of you, our doctors, all of our trainers, all of our uh, partners. So uh, the decision of our company to do free of charge such kind of webinars, because in such war situation, we understand that we should not stop on one level. We should learn all the time. So dear colleagues, it was pleasure with, to me first of all, to be with you. And I hope my presentation was very useful for you. So I'm waiting for your feedback and I'm waiting your question on Arctas Experts Group on Facebook. My contacts is, uh, I, can re I can reply this, this slide. You can find my email, alvina.aptas.ru or you can find me on Instagram, Albina Abda. So I'm ready to answer all your questions. And uh, see you, see you, my dear colleagues. Bye bye. Stay safe. George, say bye. Albina, you exceed the number of listeners today of mine from the next, from the last webinar. Woman more power. than thousand doctors, uh, more than I, th I think one thousand two hundred or something like this. So yeah. you exceed my numbers. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Congratulations. See you, my dear colleagues. Bye bye. 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 How to close?